What is up guys, welcome back to another video. Right, so it's Wednesday the 24th of April today. It's just coming up to eight o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna head out on a morning walk, but I'm not taking you through a day in the life for a while, so I thought I'd pick up the camera and take you through one. I've got to go to the gym, I've got, I'm gonna show you my whole diet. I'm actually going out with my mum. We've got a few things planned, so let's get into it. I'm just gonna have my coffee first. Yeah, look at this new setup here as well. So we've got a clothing rail now here. So all the stuff that comes in, I can make videos. We've still got loads of phone cases. If anybody's got an 8 Plus, let me know. I'll give you some Primark stuff, Boohoo stuff, swimming short haul come in. There's loads of stuff, but this is going to be like for the outfits. So I'm going to start making regular outfit videos. And I can just put it all on there. Because it looks pretty good in the video. But yeah, I've got a little coffee. And yeah, to be fair, like, I am still dieting down. Um trying to get a little bit leaner so I'm intermittent fasting in the morning which means I just push all my food back to later on in the day so I don't have my first meal till like half 11, 12 o'clock in the morning and um, that's just what works for me, it not, might not work for you I like having a lot of my food later at night just because I can get a lot of my work done in the morning so I've got a black coffee, some water and I'm taking these like vitamins as well Vitamin D3, cod liver oil. But yeah, I'll catch back up with you when I'm back from the morning walk. It's not as nice as weather today, but can't complain, can be really. Just got back from the morning walk, guys. To be fair, it's just nice to get out in the mornings pretty early and just clear your head, listen to some music or listen to a podcast or audiobook and just just like you know, breathe in that fresh, it sounds weird but like breathe in that fresh air, it actually makes a big difference and it wakes you up as well, like I feel a lot more awake now, whereas if I would have just stayed inside before, I'd probably start like feeling tired more, but I'm just going to crack on with a bit of work this morning, got to do some emails and um, editing, a few um, emailing lists and that sort of, but um, if you're watching this, the hoodies, when you pull over hoodies, so you've got them in white and you've got them in black, the sulfate ones, they're now live on the website. So first link in the description, make sure you go and have a look. £32, there's not that much stock in, but there should be enough to like um, cater for everybody. So go and have a look guys, really nice hoodies, dead comfy. Um, but yeah, right. let me crack on with a bit of work. Catch up with you soon. So I just got quite a lot of work done on my Mac, on my computer. I'm just um, putting some tags on the swimming shorts which are going to be releasing early May. I'm actually not sure on a date, maybe like, maybe like the 8th of May or 10th of May, something like that. Very early May anyway, but we've got red, which I think is sick. We've obviously got the sulfate tag, little logo on the bottom left. Really, really nice. I think they're going to be about 16, 17 pounds. And we've got them in black, which I think is underrated as a swim short, to be fair. You just can't go wrong with black. Look pretty sick. But yeah, they'll be coming out soon. I'm just literally putting these tags in. And we've also got the minimal branding t-shirts with just the logo on the back of the neck here. Um, instead of dead big on the chest, so that'll be coming soon. But I'm going to crack on with this and I'm going to film a swim short haul. Because I've got loads and loads from ASOS to try and because... I want to try and find the best ones for you guys. So I've literally got, there's a sulfate pair there because I'm going to wear them. But we've got probably like 15 pairs. So I'm going to go through all them. And then everybody this summer is going to be looking so good, aren't they? Everyone on the beach is going to be in the best swim shorts and the best shape. But yeah, hopefully this channel can help you do that. Yeah, so I got done filming a swimming short video, now I'm just filming a Primark haul. Like sometimes I do film in the same day just because obviously I actually work as well. I do have a job and I've got sulfate, I've got quite a lot of stuff going on. I go to the gym every day. So I try and batch create content sometimes. And um, so that's why I've switched my t-shirt. Don't want it to seem like it's the same day. But obviously if you're watching this, doing three videos in one day. 
We've got loads of stuff here for Primark. I'm going to try it all on. It'll be in this video, filmed on this camera. So it might, I don't know which one's going to be up first. Who knows? But to be fair, this is probably the biggest Primark haul I've ever done. Summer, I thought I'd get loads of stuff in. It looks pretty decent. All right, guys, so we've got omelette, bacon, sausages, cucumber, tomato, pikelet. The butter I've got is pretty bad and doesn't melt. <laughs> It just like sits on top because it's like two calories. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna eat this and then head to the gym. So guys, at the minute, you just saw what I ate then. Like the heck sausages, bacon, egg whites. I am about four weeks into the diet now and I've, I've lost a bit of weight, but to be fair, like I went to Budapest. I, I went fell off the diet a little bit there. The weekend I had like a few drinks, so I need to fucking smash it now. My calories are now 2,500, protein about 200 grams, carbs around like 280, and fats around 70. So that's what I'm having at the minute. If you want me to do a full day of eating, like where I just go through everything, what I eat, let me know in the comments. I'll get that involved because this channel before, you know, did used to be just like all fitness, before I had like any subscribers really. So if you want me to bring back more like full days of eating, food challenges, stuff like that, let me know. and. Uh, see what I can do. I am actually going to have a pre-workout as well today so what we've got is the my protein one. If you do want to get anything from my protein, the flavour I have got is this blue raspberry one. If you can see it the light. Um, but yeah like all the supplements I take if any is from my protein. You can get 35% off with my link in the description. It's just Josh Soul. you'll get 35% off but to be fair like protein bars, pre-workout, Vitamins and minerals and stuff like that, creatine, they're the only things that you really need. You don't need, you can have a protein powder as well, but you don't need like all the other stuff, all the rubbish. It's just, it's just false advertising really. I just get it to make the diet easier. So we'll just have one scoop of this, let's put this down. One scoop of this, I don't usually have pre-workout all the time to be fair, but just fancy it, fancy to have a decent session. It does help as well. All right, there we go. Put a little bit of this in as well, and it tastes well and nice. No added sugar of him, so. Just a switch. Ready to go to the gym. Push day today as well, so chest, shoulders and triceps. Probably one of the best sessions, isn't it? Very happy to have the S3 back, but right, there's still something wrong with it. So I finally got it back after however long it was, but it's making like a weird squeaking noise where the actual impact from the crash was. So I took it back the same day to the guy and was like, come on, it's been that long and it's not fully fixed. It's making a noise. You can't really hear it until I'm driving, but it's like the suspension um, at the top. It's like a rubber thing that encases a suspension. It's like a ball and socket joint, basically, like your shoulder. And it's like, it's like dry. So there's no um, lubrication, which is like causing the squeak, which is very annoying, but it's going back in. It's going to be sorted. I'm just glad I've got it back, to be honest. Very annoying having a crash. Um, yeah, don't recommend having one. Try to avoid it at all costs. Because more than anything, right, it's just a big inconvenience, like ringing the insurer, sorting all that shit out. Very time consuming. So, let's head to the gym. Gotta go post office, drop a few things off, a few orders and packages. What's up guys? So I actually just went to afternoon tea with my mum. I got it her for Mother's Day as a present. And I actually forgot about it, so I know I'm on the diet, but I went anyway, like, you gotta do stuff with your family and friends, aren't you? Like, even if you're on a diet, you just kind of, you, you have to, do you know what I mean? So I've not eaten that much today. I'm gonna, for the rest of the day, hardly eat anything. Maybe just like chicken or chicken from Nando's because I'm going Nando's with Ben. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna shoot some product shots now. I'm gonna shoot for the hoodies, swim shorts, for the website pictures, just in my bedroom. Got the, the light just there. And I'm gonna upload them to the Sulfit Clothing website. And yeah, pick Ben up later. Head to Nando's and then watch the derby. So that's basically my day. At the gym, I didn't film anything because I was in a rush. I know I never film anything, but 
It's really hard to film in my gym. It's a bit awkward unless you've got a tripod. It's very hard to film, so I might have to get a proper tripod to take in. Um, but yeah, I did push. It was like a 50 minute session. It was quite nice actually. Flat bench, hammer strength, shoulder press, chest press, lateral raises, chest flies, some triceps at the end. Um, but yeah, that's it. I'm going to take the product shots now. I'm going to catch up with you soon. Alright guys, so I've got all the product shots done. Just going to head out to Nando's, grab some food rapid, come back, watch United, and then I'm going to sort my website out for tomorrow. Out, oh, out. This is what I'm wearing. We've got a leather jacket, sulfur essential, Jack Jones cargoes. Just going to whack some Converse on as well. But yeah, I'll catch back up with you when I come home. I'm not going to take the camera just because I've not seen Ben for ages, so I'm sticking a camera in his face. It's pretty bad, isn't it? Alright guys, so I got back home after the Nando's. It was pretty nice to be fair. Nice little catch up with Ben. I'm knackered today. Pretty long day to be fair. Started pretty early. Got a lot of stuff done. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to sleep. I'm going to wake up in the morning. I'm going to show you like my physique update. So about four weeks into the diet and I'll show you what I'm actually looking at like now compared to at the start in the same spot in the same lighting. So I'll catch back up with you in the morning. Hopefully I'll have a good night's sleep. It's a nice rest. Alright guys, so this is how I'm looking, about halfway into my diet. To be honest, I'm feeling quite bloated, I've not had the best of weekends, so I'm going to smash it this week, and then about four or five weeks left until I go away. So I should be looking a lot better, but still not bad. I'm just starting to come out a little bit more. Yeah guys, that is it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to drop it a like. Check out Sulfit Clothing down below. The hoodies are now live as well. And the swim shorts and the essential tees will be coming very soon. So I'll catch you on the next one, guys. See you later.